All smells here with Giggly Chickity. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Whatever time it may be, welcome to my channel. So today I wanted to talk about dandruff. Um, if you've been watching my channel, you know I have dandruff. And when I switched from just like regular shampoos that had sulfates and had everything, from that to Diva Curl, like from using Diva Curl, that helped my dandruff. I don't know if it was just Diva Curl or it could have been that it was natural. Yeah, go ahead and get it. Um, that it was natural, but it helped my dandruff a lot. Like, a lot, a lot. So, from me using Diva Curl, I always use the Build Up Buster. I don't use Diva Curl anymore because of what has been going on. You know, what's been going on. And so, like, I've been on my journey trying to figure out which shampoo I can use and which conditioner is the best for me. And it's annoying because you have to like keep buying conditioners and shampoos and you don't want to. So I did my research and I hope my research helps you from having to try all of these shampoos in case you have dandruff. So my dandruff was up top right here like really really bad and I was getting it up here to like all around the top of my forehead and in the middle and I'm like what the heck is going on so I would use the build up buster before and I'd use this um, by Cantu natural hair cleansing cream shampoo and this really helped too but it just wasn't going away and so I tried the Aveeno. This is the apple cider vinegar blend. I tried this. And my favorite of most of all time is this Cantu Shea Butter Apple Cider Vinegar Vinegar Root Rot Root Rinse. <laughs> so that's a tongue twister. Um it has tea tree oil and that's supposed to help with the dandruff. It's a gentle, it's a gentle um, scalp detox, deeply cleanses scalp. This is my favorite. And it was working for me for a while. And then all of a sudden, my hair started going crazy and I ran out of this and nobody was selling it. Nobody was selling it at all. And so Amazon finally got a stock of it and I bought two of them. This is my favorite. Um. I also tried this one. This is Shea Moisture Jamaican, Jamaican, Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen and Restore Shampoo. I'm just gonna read it slower because I'm kind of talking fast. So I like I like this and it makes my hair shiny, but it doesn't do what I wanted. Like when I use a shampoo, I like it to lather and I like it my scalp to feel tingly because I have dandruff and I want to feel like my scalp is clean and I want to go longer than two days without having to wash my hair so I also tried the head and shoulders supreme color protect with argan oil and honey so this is their new natural line um, before I started Diva Curl and all my journey I used to get I used to use head and shoulders that works for me but it's like you have to use a certain um, head and shoulders for you to get that tingly and this is like kind of tingly I don't know if it's from it being natural but it was okay to me and this is the last one that I used I used the salsa and blue my dad uses this he gets dandruff sometimes he uses this and it has the the Soul Fade Percent One. I'm not sure if this one has it. This has, okay. So this one has Percent One. This one felt okay. So I use these both one time. I use this one time. I use this one time. And I use these multiple times. This one's okay. It's okay. I feel like I wanna like it, but I just don't like it. But this is a must, and this is a must. These are amazing. And I tried this. If you have like semi kind of flaky hair, this is good for your um, scalp. But how I cured my dandruff in the front, like got rid of like those clumpy 
big old flakes in my hair is this. I don't like the way it smells. It feels amazing. It like has like a lingering smell. I don't like it, but it works. So I use this. I use it one time. I think I could get away with using this once a month. And because I don't like putting a whole bunch of stuff on my scalp because it just feels nasty and I don't like it. But this has sulfur 2% in it for anti-dandruff. And whoever made this stuff, I tried the um, shampoo a long time ago and the shampoo is not as good as the sulfur. This stuff is like heaven in a bottle. If you are experienced like, it feels like sand in your hair and it's hard. And, and so when I wash my hair and I use it, I, at first I put water in my hair like I, I don't get in the shower yet. And so I just spray it on my scalp, the um, water in a bottle, I use purified water in a bottle and then I'll put this on there. See it has like a little tip. I love this. I love this. I just washed my son's hair with it. Oh, it has a hole in it. But, um, I put it on there like this. First water. And then I use this little edge brush. I don't do my edges and I don't like edges. I just feel like if it's natural, then it's natural. But this little comb brush and this little edge brush is the best edge brush. I had another one and it feels cheap. Like this one feels like a good quality edge brush. So after the shampoo is on there, I just go in and get all of it off so I feel like it's clean. And then I'll hop in the shower, rinse it out, and then I'll go in with this again just to make sure all my dandruff is out. Sometimes I even put like a little a hand mirror in there and I let it like hang from the shower so I can see that my scalp is getting clean because my dandruff is annoying. Like I thought it was gone for good, but it wasn't. It just like snuck up on me. So out of all these shampoos that I've tried for dandruff, this is number one. That's if you like the tingly and you feel like your hair is clean. This can too, apple cider vinegar root rinse is the best. And this sulfur eight works. Um, number two, I would go with this. The can too shea butter for natural hair sulfate free cleansing cream shampoo. I would go with this. Number three, I would have to say, and the reasonable prices. This, you're not gonna be able to find in Walmart. You might, you can look around, you can look at CVS, but this was on Amazon for sure. This is at Target, I know that. I know that this is at Target. Um, this one's okay, it's all right. The Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil. And then these, the rest of them, this is just no feeling at all, but it has the apple cider vinegar, um, clarify and shine shampoo. It's okay. And then these are just whatever. I mean, they're whatever. They're good, but they're not as good as this. I will go with this and this. So, oh yeah, and when you are in the shower, you can also like get one of these things. They help to clean your scalp too. Or one of these. I like this because this is like a, a rubbery. But this one like really like cakes it up. So you could like cake it up, like get it all out and then use this. These are amazing. But definitely get this because this thing helps with, with getting all the clumps out of your hair. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you guys, and um, I just want to say, be safe. If you have to wear a mask, wear a mask. Just right now, just stay away from everybody, like, because, you know, we don't know exactly what's going on. <laughs> and you just want to say, stay safe and prayed up. 
You guys have a blessed day. Goodbye. Say bye bye. You say bye bye. Say bye bye. It always comes in at the end. That's crazy. <laughs> bye.